Okay, guys. So basically, what we got now, you've got your uh, background image printed out. It's actually reverse. So any printing is in the reverse manner. Okay. So what we've got to do, we're going to use this gel medium. It's like a gel. It's like basically it's a real thick sort of paint. We're going to paint it onto this. We're going to stick that onto there, and then we're going to use the two brushes to roll it out. What I'm going to do, let's um, it's going to get a bit of this. So it's really, really thick and gluggy. Oh, nice. Yeah, so what we're going to do, we're going to roll that on. And what I want you to do is like, just got to spread it right out there. All right, so just rolling it out. So you get a nice consistency like that. Not too much. Okay, and then what we do, we can just place it onto our image. That's the wrong one, sir, isn't it? Oh, good. And I'm going to flip that over. Okay, and then we get this the furry paintbrush and we roll that, that out because we, we want to get all the air bubbles out of the back of it. Okay, if you've got any air bubbles, the paint won't stick, right? We do, we just lift it up. I don't want you to push your fingers in there because if you push down, what that's doing is pushing the glue or the paint away from that spot and the, the image won't stick to, to that part. So you want to actually have a little bit of a gap between the wood and the paper, right? But this has actually got dry paint on it. Okay, like I want you to clean the brushes up really, really well because otherwise, like we actually have to chuck that one out, okay? So basically you want to make it nice and new again. So if I ask you to clean it up, I want you to really clean it out in the water, like squish it around 20, 30 times, get all the white stuff out of it. 